Number 8. Friedingen, Germany This frozen fox was used as a frosty warning by one South German hotelier, and Mr. Stila said it was not the first animal he had found encased in ice. Stila, an experienced hunter, was walking along the icy Danube River, the second longest river in Europe, when he made the discovery in January of 2017. The unfortunate Mr. Fox was removed fully intact from the river in a giant ice cube. Having previously discovered frozen deer and wild boars, Stila displayed the fox in front of his family hotel as a stark warning to visitors, locals, and presumably animals alike of the potential dangers of getting too close to the river's edge. The shock of the cold meant the fox would have drowned almost instantly after presumably breaking through thin surface level ice. Its lifeless body would have frozen solid and, consequently, become buoyant enough to float back on the surface of the Danube. Number 7. South Dakota, USA At a glance, you'd be forgiven for thinking this image of fish frozen in time looks as if they'd missed migration. Not quite the Canadian salmon run, these fish were found in the frozen lakes of North Dakota. A regular visitor of Lake Andes, kindergarten teacher Kelly Preheim, captured the frozen fish bursting from the ice in 2015. The reason behind the unusual occurrence is fourfold. Due to recent droughts in South Dakota, the water levels were low, and as the lake froze, snow settled on the surface, and the oxygen levels in the water dropped. Without sunlight, plants and algae in the lake could not photosynthesize, consequently suffocating the fish trapped under the surface. With the oxygen levels depleted, the now dead fish floated to the surface just like ice cubes in your favorite tasty beverage. Then, finally, as driving winds hit and freezing temperatures flew in, the ice began to buckle, leaving the impression that the fish were frozen in midair. Word about the free fish suppers didn't take long to spread, and hundreds of bald eagles flocked to the area to feast on the thousands of fish. Easy pickings for one of the largest birds of prey in America. Number 6. Siberia, Russia Siberia is arguably the toughest place on the planet to inhabit, and that goes for humans and native animal species alike. One misstep can land you in a whole puddle of trouble, as one 1,300-pound moose found out in 2013. The moose had fallen into an ice hole and become stuck, unable to pull herself back onto the surface. Her luck had not run out completely, though, as four men were flying through the remote Siberian taiga in a lightweight helicopter. The landscape was sprawling, but they spotted her from above and realized quickly she was still alive. The crew flew back to the helicopter manufacturing facility where they happened to work to retrieve items in the hope of rescuing her from a potentially icy grave. As temperatures were below 20 Fahrenheit, no one knew how long she'd been trapped or how long she'd last. Upon their return with ropes and harnesses, they found she was still clinging to life. Leg by leg, they pulled the giant moose, which weighed as much as half an SUV, from the ice. In under three minutes, the three men had gotten her back on top of the frozen swamp. It was only then they realized she was pregnant. The moose, who had now been named Munka, was frozen stiff. Unable to move, her fur was frozen solid. Desperate to make this a successful rescue mission, the men covered Munka in their coats and rubbed her to induce blood flow. She was breathing, but not moving, and it was determined they had done all they could. They packed up, and as they took back to the skies, Manka rose to her feet. These kind men appeared to have saved both mother and calf. But as they flew off, they had no idea what her fate would be. Five days later, she was spotted again from the air. Easily identifiable now, she was sporting a shiny new blue collar and was observed to be in good health, making for a truly heartwarming story in every sense of the word. Number 5. Alaska, USA This pair of moose were not quite so lucky. Having been found with barely their antlers visible above a solidly frozen lake below, hiker Brad Webster discovered the bodies of the two males, known as bulls, while out trekking with friends near a remote village in Yunlukleet, off Alaska's west coast. 
The two moose were locked together by the antlers, likely trying to impress a female when they became entangled. Brad and friends found the pair in February, which would have been the climax of mating season for these giant creatures. It's been known for many horned species to become locked during a sparring session, but this may be the first instance in which time appears to have frozen around it. When large animals like this fall into the water and they're unable to kick from the bottom, it is rare that they can rescue themselves. Former university lecturer and retired biologist Bill Samuel surmised that one or both of the creatures were injured in the fight, and that after becoming locked, they drowned together in frigid water. Isn't nature a cold mistress? Number 4. Oslo, Norway Did you hear what happened to the frog that tried to cross the frozen lake in January of 2014? He croaked. Norwegian photographer Svein Nordrum happened upon a once-in-a-lifetime shoot when skating near his home in Oslo, Norway. The 54-year-old was skating on Lake Biddingsvann with his girlfriend, when he found the amphibian who appeared to have been caught out by an unreasonably warm, albeit brief, spell throughout January. As temperatures rose, the frog's body would have slowly warmed and come out of its natural hibernating state, believing spring had sprung. Unfortunately for the frog, it had jumped to the wrong conclusion. Rapidly dropping temperatures as he hopped across the pond would have slowed the cold-blooded reptile's heart down and begun to induce a state of hibernation. Its eyes were frozen shut, and its legs were splayed, physically showing how the frog was overcome by the Baltic conditions amid its best efforts to return to the shelter. Number 3. Yakutia, Russia Discovered in Yakutia, Russia, these two tiny cave lion cubs were found frozen after being preserved by the ice for over 20,000 years. They were so perfectly preserved with fur still intact, and scientists determined that the kittens were so young that they hadn't even had the chance to open their eyes. These two are the first of their kind to be found with minimal decomposition, so much so that even the contents of their stomachs could be examined. Researchers believe that the kittens, who may have only been a few days old, perished when their den collapsed around them after evidence of dirt was found in their digestive tracts. No evidence of their mother's body was found in the den. Cave lions, also sometimes known as steppe lions, are an extinct subspecies of today's African lions. Steppe refers to a large area of flat, unforested grassland, and it is believed these animals would roam these open plains using caves for shelter and to raise their young. Previous discoveries of these animals have only given paleontologists partial skeletons or fossilized tracks to work from. Minimal available evidence means that much about this animal remains conjecture. But with this first discovery of fully intact DNA, maybe things will really start to heat up in academic circles. Number 2. Space World Kitakyushu a theme park in Japan received a rather frosty welcome after the opening of their new skating rink. The park, located in the city of Kitakyushu in southwest Japan, received backlash, not just locally, but from people around the world. Locals and people further afield were shocked to find the park had frozen some 5,000 fish into the rink, displaying some to welcome skaters with a hello or point them in the right direction around the ice. The floundering general manager of the park, Mr. Toshimi Takeda, said, We had intended to give the feel of the ocean. In reality, they appear to have somehow missed the water when falling out of the boat. People called the gimmick cruel, immoral, and weird. Shortly after opening the fish-filled rink, it was closed to the public and the park issued an apology. The fish were procured from a local market and included mackerel, sprats, crabs, and other shellfish. Thankfully, the park stopped before going as far as entombing stingrays or whale sharks below the frozen surface, having instead elected to use photographs of the animals beneath the ice. Takeda told reporters the park would unfreeze the skating rink to remove the fish, hold an appropriate religious service, and then reuse them as fertilizer, adding that the fish were already dead before they were frozen. Number 1. Yuka the Woolly Mammoth Suspended in animation for over 39,000 years, 
Yucca, the woolly mammoth, was found in 2010 in the Siberian permafrost, having been mummified towards the end of the Upper Paleolithic Era, also commonly known as the Late Stone Age. Yucca is not only our oldest animal on the list, but she is, to date, the best preserved woolly mammoth in the world. Lead researcher Semyon Grigoriev theorized that the mammoth fell into the water or got bogged down in a swamp and was unable to free herself. Analysis of the tusks and teeth state that Yuka must have been between six to eight years old when she was naturally mummified. As a juvenile, she still measured over six and a half feet long, while standing in her natural position would still have been almost five and a half feet tall. Fully grown adult males would normally grow as tall as an African elephant, somewhere in the range of 10 to 12 feet, and weigh around six tons. Amazingly, even after being frozen for a millennia, scientists were able to extract flowing blood from the mammoth. Dr. Grigoriev hoped to confirm the belief that there may have been a natural antifreeze in the blood of woolly mammoths. Whilst this theory was later in part confirmed, thanks to their unique hemoglobin allowing blood to literally run cold, Grigoriev never got to achieve his real dream of cloning woolly mammoths back into existence. He sadly passed away after suffering a heart attack at just 46 years old in 2020. It is thanks to the efforts of him and his team that since 2014, crowds have been gathering in Moscow, where Yuka continues to be on display to show all to see what was walking the earth tens of thousands of years before. Thanks for watching. Would you rather have to start every morning with a polar bear swim in a freezing lake? or a run in 90 degree Fahrenheit weather? Let us know in the comment section below.